come and get it. What's going on YouTube? How's everyone doing today? So guys, a couple videos ago, I made a video on saying, like, I pretty much wanted to start up this series where I would review, review people's channels and potentially help them gain subscribers and kind of help themselves get out there a little bit more. I understand that I only have 430 subs right now, um, but I can still give my input and give my feedback out to other channels because sometimes channels don't get that. And I'm going to start off with Alpha Minions channel. He's been sticking around my channel for a little bit now. And I've subscribed to him. I think he has some really fun uh, content, really great content as well. Uh, but we're just going to be kind of like looking at some of his videos, looking at his like overall channel pa channel page in general, and we're just going to kind of like give him some input, give him some feedback, so hopefully um, he can help grow his channel out in the future. Um, but just like looking at the start, his banner looks really good, and his profile picture looks really good. I think both of them really like like they don't like potentially like stick out, but I think they are both very well done. Um, but just like looking right at the videos also, and this is my first time looking at his channel as well, so I'm not really I'm not really aware of everything about his channel but like just like looking at it the biggest thing what people like look at whenever they're looking for YouTube channels is consistency and obviously I struggle with that um, but I use the other like things so well I do the other things so well that it help it doesn't it matters because I could be getting more subscribers than I what I already do but like at the same time it doesn't because I still gain my gain subscribers because of what else I do but a consistency is a very very big thing that uh, people look for whenever they're looking for uh, other gaming channels uh, but like if you just look at this like three days ago, two weeks, three weeks, three weeks, three weeks, three weeks, one month, and it gets into like a month and stuff. Which is like I'm not sure when all these videos were uplo uplo uploaded, but I'm assuming they're like all pretty consistent. It's just right here is like a little bit, there's a little bit of un inconsistency right here. And that's where like uh, people can start like stop following you. And if you do have an already of following, they might like unsubscribe because you're not putting out content that they're wanting. And you, they might they uh, they might like not like your videos, not ever view your page, just again. Just because you're not consistently putting out content. Um, now, I would recommend using more playlists. Um, you only have two playlists going on right now, man, and you only have two in this one and one in this one. Always use playlists because usually, uh, when someone's like looking for a series, looking for something, they always look for playlists because it's like all, everything's usually all the way in order and it's very easy to find stuff. So, I really recommend making playlists, like maybe like a League of Legends playlist um, of like montages, and then like another League of Legends playlist about gameplay or something like that, or I don't know, just something along those lines, just to like kind of help you out a little bit, or you know, like montages or something like that. Um, and then let's just click on one of your videos real fast, also, man. Uh, we'll come over here to this video. We'll just pause it. Like, like the video quality is important. It's like a really big thing on like the quality of videos and like wh whether or not people click on them. And thumbnails are a huge thing. I thought all your thumbnails were really good. I forgot to mention that earlier, but I thought all your thumbnails were pretty good. Um, they all look pretty. Not like the same, but they all have like the unique thing to them where people like would want to click on them. And whenever you're making videos, you want to ask yourself, what would make someone want to click on this video? Why would someone want to watch this video over another video? And that's what I ask myself daily. And sometimes I'm like, I don't know why they would click on it, and I'm just gonna make it anyways because I enjoy it. Um, but okay, just jumping right into it. So the big thing, and this is what I talk about with like all my friends, is uh, the is the uh, title. Um, now, Elo Montage Warwick, the Unkillable Wolf, like that's like I always recommend to all my friends that put like what you're doing like after what you're talking about. So like if you're talking about like the uh, like Warwick, I do the Unkillable Wolf Warwick Montage League of Legends or something like that instead of Elo Montage Warwick because like if you think about it, like there's so many montages out there. What makes yours different than other someone else's? What makes that your montage that you're making currently? different than someone else's montage that they already have like out there like i get it i understand why why uh why you have a title like this but at the same time you gotta think about why would someone click on this title or in this thumbnail over someone else's title or thumbnail um now we're just gonna jump down in your description and okay well you don't you don't have a description um there's and your description just says don't forget to leave a like and uh for this new lol montage now I, I think description is very important on all the videos, and description can really help you get noticed more as well. So whenever, whenever you're doing in the video, just like kind of talk about what you did in your video. Like, hey, I did this montage on Warwick, blah, 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 and talk about like what, like what you're doing in the game, I guess, just a little bit. And then like kind of like throw in some social medias down there and then like kind of like leave something for your subscribers so they can always see something. And like always don't forget, like always um, add like hashtags as well because this is a new thing on YouTube. From like I don't know a couple months ago, where it's like hashtag League of Legends, so more people who uh, can find your video 
easier. Um, I always tell my friends to um, inc like increase their descriptions because if you look at my description compared to like their descriptions and your description, for example, like my description is just so much longer and there's so much more to my description. And I'll show you guys here in a little bit what my descriptions look like. Um, my voice is cracked. Holy crap. Uh, but, uh, what my descriptions look like um, compared to this one currently. And then also right here, your tags. You need to make sure you use as many tags as possible. Like, make sure it's all unique with what you're doing. So, like, you could also throw in, like, uh, Warwick uh, League of Legends montage, League of Legends Warwick montage, the Unkillable Wolf, um, like, whatever else you want to add here over here. And I would, like, think about it. But you always want to like, use as many tags as possible that pertains towards your video. Because that's when they start getting noticed. Like if I showed search rankings here, like these won't get searched at all. Like yes, they will. They will get searched. But when you click on this, like it's a very poor overall score. And what I'm using right now is TubeBuddy, with it, which they've helped me out a lot. Like if let's say you threw in like uh, Warwick. Oh shoot, that's not how you spell it. Yeah, it is. I'm stupid. Warwick League of Legends montage, and then export it. Like this is a 60. Like it's already like this is gonna be a lot better of a score than um like the search rating than your other one. Like yeah, it's more like exact on what they would need to type in. But like if someone did type that in, your video would be way up higher on the list instead of not being relevant at all on the list. So really work on tags, description, and maybe change up your title a little bit. Your title might have like a little bit of uh, impact on your video, which. I mean, it do, I mean, sorry, I'm so sorry. It has a lot of impact on your video, not a little bit. It has a lot of impact on your video because, like, if your title is just Warwick Montage, more than likely no one's really going to click on it just because it doesn't, it's not anything different than every other Warwick Montage. Like, if your title says something, like, out of the ordinary, like, you would probably get more clicks on it than someone else would uh, with just, like, a regular Warwick Montage. So definitely work on title, increase your description a lot, and then make sure you use all your tags. Um, now I'm just going to compare this video right here to an, uh, to one of my videos. Um, and I'm not like s saying my videos are better than his or anything by that means. I just want to compare, um, here we'll just do this one right here because this is my like latest uh, Rangar video. But we're just going to compare this uh, video to my video. Now, now if you like, so starting off, like my title, like do doesn't talk about League of Legends at all because it's inferred. When you're talking about like Rengar or Warwick, it's inferred you're playing League of Legends. People are already assuming you're playing League of Legends. Just because like what other game has Warwick or Rengar in it. Now if I add a League of Legends to my title, it wouldn't affect anything or anything like that. Uh, my title is just different than his and his title could work for him. You just gotta find like that little area where the titles start really start working. But like in my description, I like talk about what I did in my gameplay. Like uh, we just play AP Rengar like the usual but uh, but can we win a game? Like whatever. I'm really bad at reading. I'm so sorry. Also, make sure you watch, watch the full video. I'm just like kind of like talking a little bit about this. Um, my descriptions are usually a lot longer. This is kind of like a bad example, I guess, because my descriptions usually talk a lot more in depth about what I'm doing. Um, and then last but not least, like um, at my current tags, like there's a lot of tags. I use there's 500 characters that you can use in tags, and you can use every single one. Now, like obviously, I'm not gonna get ranked top on every single one. Um, but like Flig Markable is ranked number two, so if you type in my name, this video will pull up number two, and then Flig Markable AP Rengar will pull up number six. Now I will show you guys something. I do have a series called Board Kings, um, and if you just type in Board Kings on YouTube, I get all my video is the first one that pull. No, it's not. It's the fourth one that pulls up. It used to be the first one, um, but it's right here. But if you type in like Board Kings tips, like first video, like if you click on this video right here. And then look at my tags and stuff like this. This is one of my the best videos that I've made on this channel. Um, but like I'm ranked number one on like pretty much every single thing that you could think of. Which I typed in board kings. I don't know. Oh, I typed in boards king kings. I'm stupid. Um, but like I'm ranked number one on almost all of these. And like this is where tags really come in handy. This is where tags really help you out because it tells you what your ranking is on per said video each video indirectly and like this is a better description as well sorry about that little beep it's for my discord um but this is pretty much like my descriptions and stuff like this um but yeah alpha man i would definitely work on your title your description for sure and then increase your tags as much as possible and i'm not guaranteeing you more success i this just uh to potentially help your, your name get out there more and help make uh like or get more people to see your channel i really hope this video does help you out man if you have any questions, make sure you join my Discord 
come you can come to um like to my two latest videos and join my Discord. Go to my Twitter or Twitch and join my Discord. Um and we can talk more through Discord if you ever need any more help. But anyways, guys, if you guys do want to see more videos like this in the future, make sure you do smash that like button. Also, if you guys are new to the channel and want to see more content like this or potentially uh, want your own channel to be critiqued a little bit and help you uh, increase your potential subscriber rate, view count, and uh, like ratio and comments, stuff like that, make sure you guys do uh, subscribe to my channel. And last but not least, make sure you guys drop a comment if you guys do want to see um, your channel get critiqued. I'm so sorry about my Discord. I don't know why it's going crazy right now. I fit where I muted it before this video. I do apologize. But anyways, guys, thank you guys all so much for watching. I love you guys all to death. And until next time, adios, amigos.